What is communication? This great nation will endure. As it has endured. Communication is the ability of a person to project understanding onto someone else. It's telling a story. And I think that that is really at the heart of what being human is. It can be as simple as a text message, an email, and somehow something happens and there's a message sent and then it is received. A lot of the, the information that we actually uh, put forth is, is unintentional, right? With our, our facial expressions, our, our body language. If that's communication, then really all human behavior is communication. Why is it important? As our world becomes more digital, more video, more photo-based, those skills needed to accomplish that uh, become more complicated and complex, and that also makes them more important, especially in an age where we're flooded with information. When you tell a story and tell a story well, when you communicate something that makes people feel good or believe in something, I think that it has a profound effect. Being a good communicator is our right as Americans. We have the right to freedom of speech. And when we don't speak effectively, it's pretty much taking that right that we have and ignoring it. There's so many individuals out there that live in a world where it's illegal to communicate. So being able to communicate effectively not only helps us in our careers and in our personal lives, but it also helps us as civic leaders and civic members of our communities. What is digital media and communication? We train students for a variety of fields, including film and visual effects, journalism, graphic design, integrated marketing communications. You know, you have that multimedia element where you're learning the video, you're learning the photography and how to introduce all those elements together. You know, because in a constantly changing media landscape, they're going to need to be able to do a little of everything. If you can take those tools with you and those skills into the workplace, your news managers will be very happy with you. You know, you're always going to come into problems that you have to solve. And I feel like a lot of us are just creative problem solvers. So every student is walking out of here as uh, an adaptable individual. So they're not coming here just to, to learn to be a filmmaker or to be a journalist. They're experiencing all of those things. What makes the Mac unique? I think what's unique about our program is we try to make sure that our students leave with skills that translate to the real world. We encourage them to participate in real world experiences. I interned with the American Red Cross, Newer Cap, Lemur Studios, Public Radio, WBFO, Parker, Spectrum News, Office Depot. Give them the sort of pressures that you might feel in a real world experience. You're running the school news website, a student newspaper, the scribe. You're getting to interact with talk radio if you want. But they're also they're going to do real professional work that they can put on a resume. With filmmaking and video editing, th that's the only way you can learn. You have to be out there and you have to actually get experience. We have a lot of hands-on work to do in classes. Most of the work that we did was projects. We also have the tools to use for those hands-on projects. They actually have a huge supply of camera equipment and if any student wanted to go out and test a camera, you would just sign one out and they would let you use it. Why study at Hilbert? I love that the school itself is really small. We're not a huge campus, and that helps our students excel as well as build relationships with each other and faculty members. The one-on-one -on -one attention that I was able to get throughout that program gave me confidence to really step out into the professional world and gave me skills that I didn't realize that were gonna be so important to be successful. They helped me grow as a person. They taught me a lot about what I need to succeed and they gave me the tools to do that. The need for communication and the need to be an effective communicator is not going anywhere. Every single employer is going to value someone who knows how to shoot a video and edit a video and write and tell compelling stories to their audience. You know, I'm confident that, you know, the skills that they're learning here are going to uh, apply, you know, no matter what happens. The communication field is something that's going to grow in a huge way in the future. Whether we're communicating through print, visual media, there will always be a need for effective communicators.